Hello and welcome to the course curriculum overview. In this video, we're going to be getting a brief overview of all the content in this course. Let's go ahead and get started. First, this course starts off with an introduction section, including this overview, a discussion on Python 2 versus Python 3, and a lecture on how best to approach this course to maximize your benefits from taking this course. After that, we'll get started with a Python setup section. We'll learn how to install Python on your computer. We'll learn about environment selection. We'll learn about the Jupyter Notebook system. You'll get access to additional learning resources online. And then we'll have a brief overview on Git and GitHub. Next, we start with the live code sections. We'll learn about object and data structure basics, including numbers, strings, lists, dictionaries, tuples, files, sets, and booleans, all in Python. After each of these individual lectures, there's quizzes to test your understanding. And at the end of this section, there's an assessment test, so you can check your knowledge on each of these topics. Afterwards, we'll get a section on comparison operators. We'll learn about both basic operators and chain comparison operators, with this section ending with a quiz to also test your understanding. Then we'll move on to Python statements, including if statements, for loops, while loops, the range function, and list comprehensions all in Python with an assessment test at the end to test your understanding. Next, we'll learn about methods and functions, what they are, how to create them. We'll also learn about Lambda expressions, nested statements in Python, and scope in Python. We'll top it off with a homework assignment to test your understanding about methods and functions. Then, you'll have your first milestone project, where you will create a game with Python. Then, we'll move on to object-oriented programming where we'll learn about objects, classes, methods, inheritance, and special methods, all in Python. Then you'll get a homework assignment to test your understanding. After that, we'll learn about errors and exception handling in Python, including what errors are, what exceptions are, and how to use try, accept, and finally to handle errors and exceptions. Then we'll top it off with a test to test your knowledge and your understanding so far in the course. Then you'll come up with your second milestone project, where you're going to create a more complex game all in Python. Afterwards, we'll learn about modules and packages in Python, how to create them, how to install them from the internet, and we'll explore the Python ecosystem in general. Then we'll move on to built-in functions in Python, such as map, reduce, filter, zip, enumerate, all and any, and even how to deal with complex numbers. At the end of this section, we'll have a final assessment test where you can test your understanding for built-in functions. Next, we'll learn about decorators in Python, a three-part series ending with a homework assignment. Afterwards, we'll learn about Python generators, including iteration versus generation discussions, how to create generators, and a homework assignment, again, to test your knowledge about ge Python generators. After that, we'll put together everything you've learned in a final capstone project. But that's not all. There's advanced bonus content, including an entire section about advanced Python modules and advanced Python objects and data structures, so you can level up your knowledge. There's new content regularly added to this section with dozens of lectures. You'll also get access to community forums and a dedicated help from me, your instructor. So that's the entire course curriculum overview. So let's go ahead and get started with the course.